All right, I decided I'm just, I'm using my phone to record, and I decided to just do my pickup in the car. Um, two sales, that's it, only two sales. I spent um, $36 today, and I think I did good because everything was ridiculously cheap, um, which is great. I always like that. Um, what did I get? What did I get? Well, here's the first thing. This was, as you can see, $2. This is a piece of Sign Studio art glass. Here's the front. There's the back. Or the, here's the front and there's the back. I don't really know. It's got an interesting shape. I looked this up. I found the artist's name. Let me see if I can read it. It was like Stephen... Stephen... Rich Nelson. <coughs> Excuse me. And it was dated 1990. I don't know what the hell that was. I was just hacking. Dated 1990. Yeah, but I don't even have cats. I don't even have fur. Um, I don't see anything wrong with it. I looked up the artist, and I believe this is worth, um, at the very least, 60 to about less than uh, 200 on, on, like, let's get insane on prices. For five bucks, I got this spoon set. It's a salad. Salad serving. Salad serving set, Marie says. And the handles are sterling. Uh, put a magnet to this. Uh, obviously, it went straight to the stainless magnet, steel. stainless steel. <clears throat> and uh, I don't really know. Uh, we figure it's worth at least 30, 40 bucks, whatever. Let me just cover that up. See, look, proof, $5 is all I paid. And I didn't negotiate. Everything I bought was so freaking cheap. I didn't, I was like, you know, I respected their prices. Here, and then I got a bag of this stuff. Oh man, stuff is falling, fell out. Um, okay, number one, got this this pin. It says Mexico silver, so it, so I guess it's not sterling, but it's definitely an old one. And it says on the back, <sighs> silver Mex silver Mexico. So I guess it's worth twenty or more, something like that. Um, yeah. Marie, does, Marie doesn't agree. Marie thought these might be silver. But they're not. Uh, it's just kind of a cool necklace. They were like a buck a piece. Got these cool uh, silver looking That's dangles. Went straight to the market. magnet. Yeah, it's flea That's market. Flea it's flea market. market. Um, sorry this is taking long. Alright, you know what? This fell out of the bag. I got this mezuzah. 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 And I got this mezuzah. And these are 10 bucks each. Uh, this one says Israel on the back and 925. I think my phone's doing a decent job. Israel 925. I believe these are worth at least, at least 30 bucks a piece. At least. And then up to like maybe 60 very easily. Um, that's what I'll be putting these on eBay for. Like uh, probably 60 or. Maybe 75, I don't really know yet. I gotta do more research. And um, this one is less ornate, but again, 10. But this one was much heavier. And I, I only saw a mark that said uh, 925s, right where the white paint on my, on my thumb is. That one I believe to be worth this. Well, you know what? Uh, I also got this. And uh, this is also sterling. The 925 is uh, in here. What did it say, Marie? It said 925 or... Israel. Israel 925, 25 right there. Had a maker's name. So it's a, just a very small, a fit in the palm menorah. of your hand, menorah, on the go, slip it in your pocket, whatever. Yeah. It's right. a travel menorah. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, look how tiny it is. What, what window would you put this in? It's like it had a really small window, right? Because that's what it's for, the windows, right? Isn't it? You put no, the menorah in a window? No, it's just for the window. Yeah, so like you light a candle or something. Is that and a different we, story? You know, wanna, you're, I know nothing about yeah, you're, 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 Jewish tradition because, you know, I'm not Jewish. But I do know what it's called. It's called a menorah. So anyway, um, 925. Uh, I'll tell you something. For those three pieces, I spent... Hear that screechy sound? For those three pieces, we spent 25. And I think I have about 120 grams of um, sterling there so for the 25 we paid about half scrap all right then there's a couple of random things in this oh this goes inside of the the bigger menorah mezuzah 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 and um 
Then I got you got two pair of earrings, right? Uh, yeah, but they're junk. And he says they're junk. they're junk. We got these Chanel, Coco Chanel. We believe they're knockoffs. Oh, Coco Chanel, Chanel. Uh, who's Coco Chanel? Oh, Jesus. That's the lady, right? Just that's her company, Coco Chanel. So why can't I say Coco Chanel? Rules. Oh, could you just get that last earring out of there? Wait, I got it. And then these, which kind of match the necklace. No, they didn't match the necklace. No. But I thought they might be silver, but they're not. Okay. That's everything I got. Quick shout outs. Uh, AJ, SCP Zonk, Video Gamer Daryl, Nas Nostalgic, uh, Marie, who's with me, uh, my daughter Daisy, uh, my mom, Adam, uh, Chase Up to the Right Price, uh, Picking for Treasure at Sherman, Living a Good Life, Bargain Barons, um, uh, Blue Bus Dave, uh, Treasure Finder, I'm behind on your videos, uh, 28, or is it Treasure Hunter? Treasure Hunter 28, I'm behind on your videos. I think that's everybody. Um, this weekend, we're not going to be around here. Where are we going to be? Westwood. Sunday. Sunday, Westwood antique thing. I'm not really taking antiques, so I'm just going to take my normal stuff. Um, anyway, I'm out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm hitting the pause button and it's...